I have been getting a ton of questions about the freelancing program that I offer. And it's really no surprise that I'm getting a lot of questions because I'm making claims like I made $32,000 in one month. I worked 20 hours a week and made $225,000 in 2019 alone. And how can you work part time and still make well above average incomes uh, consistently in the Salesforce space? And a lot of people are saying, well, how is it possible? Are, are you charging $400 an hour? I mean, how can you get these numbers? So I want to explain to you, number one, the massive value of this course and why right now, I mean, you can go to the sales page. You'll see the link in the video description. This is worth every penny plus probably triple that. And of course I'm biased, but you can ask the people who are in the group. Again, we have no returns on this because everyone understands how much value there is. So I wanna walk you through the value and help explain it. I've been doing some live demos with individuals, but I think if I can really do a live demo right here uh, for everyone to see, then that can add a ton of value. So uh, take this opportunity to sit down and see we are gonna do a live session right now um, to make sure that you can see the inside of what's going on in this course. And I'm really gonna show you some things that uh, are probably a little too far from my perspective. They're probably gonna give you a little too much value where you can pause the video and take a look at what it says and try to sort of take the value out of it. But I can guarantee you that the course alone, this video alone, uh, is not nearly what the full value add is of this course. And I'm gonna explain that to you right now. So let's check it out. Now, when you come to the sales page, and you'll see this in the video description, you're going to get some basic stuff. You're going to get uh, an intro to what the course is. Uh, you're going to see that you can get these one hour live group sessions every week. And we, we typically have right now we have 62 members uh, who are in the program and typically on the live coaching calls due to scheduling uh, issues and constraints, maybe only uh, 10 to 15 people, so about 25% of the group, show up for any individual coaching call. So what that means is for those one hour coaching calls, there may only be 15 people on the call and only five people asking specific questions. So that means it's it's very small group. It's very one-on-one. -on -one. So if you have questions, they're going to get answered. And we can meet you where you are, talk about the specifics of where you are in your freelance or what I like to call the independent consulting journey. And we can make sure that we develop you from the ground up. And the amazing thing is you get lifetime access. So you can go to these coaching calls uh, you know, for as long as you like. Now you're gonna notice one thing where I do put a limit on it and I say you can only attend four coaching calls. What that really is, is it's to protect me for the day that maybe I don't wanna do coaching calls anymore or the structure of the group changes. I know that I only owe each group member four coaching calls. So don't be turned away when you see something like you can only attend four. As it stands right now, we're gonna be doing this for years to come and you are going to be able to attend those coaching calls for years to come. So if you buy today, and you decide you don't want to deal with this until January, but you want to lock in today's price to make sure, you know, we started this off at, it was $300 to get into the freelance group. It went up to $400. Now it's $447. And as the group grows and as the content grows and as it becomes more valuable, the price is going to continue to go up. Um, so there is a little bit of urgency in that if you lock in the price today, you don't even have to look at this course for the next six months. You're still going to have access. You're still going to have live coaching calls and you're going to have even more value from the add-ons to the course as time goes on. So just keep that in mind. Now coming down, you can see the pricing as it stands today. Again, there is no guarantee that this pricing stands, uh, as demand grows, as the course value grows, uh, you will, will see the price go up. Um, so it's 447 today if you buy it outright you can do four payments of 125 uh, so that makes it a flat five uh, 500 or you can do 10 payments of 60 dollars a month which makes it 600 but this allows you to cash flow it so if you pay 125 a month chances are by the time you're in month two month three you're easily going to be landing your first clients and that means your clients are going to be paying the bill for this anyway and then after four months everything's gravy on top, right? Like all the money you're making. And when we're talking about uh, average freelance rates of $100 per hour, you can, uh, you can basically work an hour and 15 minutes 
and pay for this course for the month by following the strategies in this course. So let's keep going. Um, we answer some basic questions about what this covers, but you don't need to read all this in the video right now. You can click the link in the description and check it out. Um, and so, so I just wanna say that we're gonna cover everything the sales page covers plus like 20X in this video. So if you wanna pause the video and read it or click the link and read it, you can, but this video is gonna give you way more value than, than any of the sort of uh, wording on the sales page or anything like that. Now, Martin Gessner from Focus on Force, uh, I had a meeting with him, he took the course, he checked it out. He used to be a Salesforce consultant and he was blown away. So immediately you'll notice if you go to Focus on Force's website, there's a banner for this course. He wrote a blog about this course. He was way on board the moment that this began. So um, I'm gonna quit showing you the sales page. Here's a brief overview of the curriculum, but instead of showing you what everybody sees on the sales page, because you're watching this video, I'm gonna take you inside the course. So let's check it out. So now we are actually inside the course. So I've jumped into a preview that I have access to obviously. Now, uh, we're going to go through what to expect in this course, who I am, commonly asked questions, but that's not the benefit, right? Like most of you already know who I am. You know, I did five years of big firm consulting. You know that I did, uh, and I'm still doing, I'm on five years of freelance consulting, averaging $170,000 a year working part-time. And now last year making 225,000 working part-time. And this year, I think I'm gonna do even better. So uh, even though my energy has shifted towards coaching, the rates are going up. I have more managed services agreements and we'll dive into all of that. So let's check this out. When we go through the course, um, we talk about simple things like a LinkedIn profile, right? But this is a huge issue for some people. They can't get it right. So I'm gonna click into this. And you can see we have, a, we have a quick video about your LinkedIn profile and why it's important. We go through keys to success and how you need to bend your LinkedIn profile specifically as a freelancer. So, so we're gonna talk to you about how to manage your LinkedIn profile specifically as a freelancer and why it is so valuable. We're gonna give you some quick tips on how to make updates there and you'll be able to watch the video here. And you'll notice a lot of my videos are pretty short. And the, the reason for that, you can see this video is like 16 minutes long. I don't need to talk to you an hour about updating your LinkedIn profile. If you know me, you know I'm focused, you know I'm fast, and you know I'm straight to the point. So I don't spend two hours talking to you about updating your LinkedIn profile. I get straight to the point. I show you step-by-step -step exactly what to do to repeat this, like this precise polished LinkedIn profile for you and make sure that you're ready to showcase yourself on LinkedIn as a freelance consultant. We move through virtual meetings and introductions. So uh, meeting with clients, especially in the COVID era, there's a lot going on virtually. So we make sure that you have a full on checklist to make sure that you are prepared for your virtual interviews. And again, Right here, we have a 22 minute video talking about exactly what to do, how to set up your background, how to set up your lighting, how to make sure that when you get on a virtual meeting, you don't look like everybody else. You look like a professional who's going to stand out from the crowd. Now, uh, when we keep going through, we do talk about building professional relationships uh, because those are super important. And you're gonna notice in a lot of these, there's a join the conversation on Facebook. And I'll talk about that in a minute. You can see I've already got the tab pulled up, uh, but joining the, the Facebook group is a huge value add and that's members only. You can't get into that without being part of the face, uh, without being part of this membership to the program. So, um, and just so there's no confusion there, sometimes I call it a membership. It's not the right word. This is a one-time fee. Once you're in, there is no upsell. There is nothing else you're ever going to pay for. Once you're in, you're in and you're in for life. So we come into this and we're going to talk some about building relationships. And the reason for this, and it's a lot of what we focus on in the Facebook group and on the live calls is you might be an expert in Salesforce and Salesforce administration. Well, guess what? Professional development is gonna help you find other people in your network who are expert developers, expert at Marketing Cloud, experts at CPQ, experts at Field Service Lightning. And we connect you with those people. So already we have 60 members in the group. We're adding about 20 members uh, a month. So you can imagine over time, we're gonna have hundreds of members in here feeding off of each other and you're all going to be 
up and coming freelancers and the people who are already in here and they're dominating it and they've spent a couple of months in the program, they're already going to be expert freelancers. Plus, I've got your back. So we're going to make sure that you're successful in freelancing if you're part of this program. Now, once we get through that, one thing I'm not going to show you are the five strategies to finding clients. So you can see we have a few different strategies. We're constantly building these out. I just added strategy number five this week. Uh, so as the group grows, I feed off of the program as much as it feeds off of me. So if I have 60 members of my group telling me about their success, telling me where they've seen failure, I can take that and I can mold the course as the group grows to make it better and more polished and tighten the bolts and make sure that this thing is top notch. So we're already having huge success. We have members who have only been in the group for a couple of weeks landing their first clients. We have people subcontracting with consulting firms for great rates. And it doesn't matter where you are today, you have lifetime access. So even if you're a beginner admin with one certification and you know you're gonna go work a W2 job, but you wanna go ahead and get in the fold join the conversations, join the live calls, see what people are doing. You can go ahead and do that so that when it's time for you to jump in as a freelancer, you're ready, you're knowledgeable, and, you're, and you can take it to the next level. If you're already good at Salesforce and you have two or three certifications, there is no reason you shouldn't be looking into freelancing. And I can tell you with confidence, this is the number one by far course that you can take specific to Salesforce freelancing and making sure that you dominate a career in freelance. So we're gonna walk you through uh, the top five strategies for finding clients, and we're going to continue to add more. Now, we then take you through uh, project process documentation. And what that means is we're gonna walk you through what a non-disclosure agreement is. This is a first step. A lot of people don't know that. This legally protects you and your client from uh, sharing information that you shouldn't be sharing about each other. So. In every section, you're gonna notice you get to download your non-disclosure agreement right here. All you have to do is pop your logo into the downloaded document, put your client's name, put your name, sign on the dotted line, non-disclosure agreement complete. Same thing with every other process document in this. So this is gonna walk you through finding a client and then it's gonna sort of hold your hand and walk you through every single step of the process from let me get the documentation in place. Let me get a contract in place with my statement of work and proposal. So again, we're gonna walk you through the statement of work and your proposal. We're gonna tell you how to use these. And then we're going to give you downloadable options depending on the type of project you wanna do. Uh, so you can do a fixed price statement of work, an hourly statement of work, or maybe a statement of work for something specific. We have data migration here, but you can mold these to be specific to the project that you're doing. And we walk you through exactly how to set those up. Then you can join the conversation on Facebook and talk to others and look at examples of what other people are doing and get advice from maybe people with more experience uh, who might be able to help you out in that area. And let me tell you, this is a Salesforce community. This is in Ohana. And everyone is very willing to help each other. And of course, I'm always there to help as well. Now, once we move through this, we're gonna help you out with uh, negotiating payment terms to make sure that you get paid on time and everyone understands when you get paid, how much you get paid. We're gonna walk you through project plans and tracking projects so you always know what you had in the contract, how much time it's taking, and make sure that you stay on point with that. Um, and again, everything has a downloadable template. So you don't have to think, you don't have to create, you don't have to figure this stuff out on your own. It's all going to be effectively done for you. You just download the template, fill in the blanks and follow the process in the videos and network on the Facebook group. So we're gonna walk you through business process reviews, how to gather requirements properly. Then we're gonna take you into requirements and design to help you document the requirements and all of the solutions properly. Uh, we're going to take you through end user training and administrator training. We're going to tell you exactly how to use these documents. Um, and we even have PowerPoint decks for you to download that are already structured out to help you get started training uh, for your clients. And then we move into the holy mecca of Salesforce freelancing, and that is managed services agreements. And this is where when people say, hey, Brad, how do you make 225K in a year working part time? This is the answer. The fact is, uh, you can get clients in these managed services agreements. And the beautiful thing about it is you may have a 30 hour managed services agreement per month. And what that means is the client is locked in at 
30 hours per month. Now, if they go over 30 hours, they have to pay you a substantial overage fee. So let's say that you have them locked in for $100 an hour, 30 hours a month. That's pretty typical. Now that's $3,000 a month, $36,000 a year for you. And you're on the hook for about seven hours a week, making $36,000 a year. If that's not enough, if they go over, you typically charge a 25% overage fee, which means you'll get paid $125 an hour for every hour over the 30 hours. But what about the other side? What if they only use 20 hours? You still get paid the full 30 hours because this is a subscribed contract that is in place and it is pre-billed at the beginning of the month. This is extremely typical in the Salesforce environment and the consulting environment in general. So it's not a sell. It's not something that clients are not used to. This is very normal. And this is how I can take a 20 hour a week job and boost it up to $225,000 a year is because I have enough managed services agreements in place that aren't being fully utilized, but I still get paid no matter what. So we talk a lot about that in the coaching calls and how to get these in place and how to convert clients from project-based to managed service agreement-based. Uh, so that's really the value you're getting. And then let me take you over to uh, the Facebook group. You'll see that we have uh, right here, we have plenty of activity going on. This is the live coaching call uh, from this week. So we walk through that. You can see we have a full hour of us talking, answering questions. You can see we had 42 comments on the call. This was yesterday, um, going through so much material. And we were going through right now, setting up a skill set matrix so that we can all feed off of each other's skills. So if you need somebody, pull them into a project that's an expert developer, we're going to have a document for uh, skill set matrix. So you can go find a developer in this document that we're going to create, and you'll be able to see all the other group members and all the other skills that they have. And you'll be in that document too, so that they can pull you in based on your expertise and everyone can work projects together um, as needed based on the expertise that each other has. So this is not binary. This is not each person in the group is competing with each other. We're working as a community. We're working as a family to make sure that everyone succeeds. Uh, so you can see, we just have so many great people um, in the group. We do have over 60 members in the program, but only 50 in the group. Um, and you can see some of the people we have. These are real business owners. These are YouTube stars uh, in the Salesforce space. These are expert content creators. These are the real deal people. And if these are part of your network, it is going to be extremely difficult to fail. Uh, you can see we have everything tagged up. Like if you, if you just want to check out the live coaching calls, you can click that tag and you can go through and watch all of the pre-recorded uh, live coaching calls that we have in the group. So you can see coming through here, we've got the one from last week. We've got the one from the week before, and you can just scroll through and watch all of the historic coaching calls. So there is endless content for you to absorb. And you are effectively, by taking this program, given the absolute best positioning and best opportunity to be a successful freelancer in the Salesforce space. I hope to see you on the other side.